Alright, everybody, welcome yourself back to another episode of my Pokemon Hardcode Ultimate Randomizer Nuzlocke, people. In the last episode, we took down the second gym leader. I forget what they were actually named. It was gonna be Bugsy, but obviously this is randomized in every way, so they weren't Bugsy. They were some random other person. And, um, yeah, I have not level grinded, as you probably saw, since there was no level grinding part at the start of the episode, I did not level grind, nothing of that sort. Everybody's still the same level from last episode, but before I overview the team, be sure to go ahead and drop a like and answer the comment question of the day. Your support is greatly appreciated. Now, let's go over the team. <laughs> so, as I said, nothing has changed from the last episode, but I may as well just give a quick overview, just in case you, you didn't see the last episode or whatever. So, um, here we obviously got Smoker, the Weavile, Fire Grass type, level 19, holding a Miracle Seed with Leaf Blade, Water Gun, Mega Horn, and Cut. Next up, we got Susan the Curlia, poor, pure normal type, with Dark Void, Mud Shot, Rock Tomb, and Petal Dance. Then we got Jugger the Ursa Ring with Wing Attack, Karate Chop, Luster Purge, and Rock Tomb, fighting in Rock type. Before we continue, let me pull up my, um, my name list. Can't forget about that. Almost did, though. <laughs> Next up, we got Shiny the Horsey, Dark Psychic type with Zap Cannon, Detect, Drill Peck, and Headbutt. Then we got David the Slowbro, Pure Ice type, holding Never Melt Ice with Supersonic Outrage, Jump Kick, and Charge Beam, level 18. And lastly, last but not least, we got Cut of the Glyscor, Pure Bug type with Grass Whistle, Water Pulse, Thunder Punch, and Bite. Now, today, people, we're probably going to be going after the Gym Leader. I don't know what else. Oh, we got... <sighs> what? What do you got? Mm. Blah, 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 okay, cool, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. okay, okay. So, as I was saying, today we're probably going to be taking on the gym leader, unless I forget that there's something to do here. Let me just look around, you know? Gotta make sure we're not missing out on anything. What's here? It's the bike shop, okay, okay. I forget, do we get it? I think we get it, like, after we, um, do the whole radio tower thing. I'm not sure, man, I, I forget certain parts of the game here and there. What do you gotta say? Gym Leader Whitney um, went flying by saying, I have to go get a radio card. I have to get a radio card. What? Alright, so I'm assuming we go to the radio tower, which is like over here? I'm assuming that's the case. Alright, so that's that. But what do we got over here? Hello? Oh, the global terminal. Oh, I forgot this was here. I completely forgot that was here in this game. Hi there. So this is the radio tower. What do you want, you pass Scram. So I guess we, we just walk up in here. Oh, hey, Whitney. Hi, my name is Whitney. I heard about the quiz to win a radio card, so I came here to get one. But this quiz is so hard. Oh. Special quiz campaign. All right, all right. You'll be able to... Okay, okay. What would, you, what would you like to... Okay, let's try the quiz. First question. Can you check the town map without a, your pokey gear? No. Dang it. Okay, let's try again. Okay, okay, blah blah blah, just, okay, yes. Yes, okay, what's next? Irina can only be female. Irina, no. Dang it. I always forgot, I just, I don't know how I forgot that to be honest, because it's Nita Reno and Nita... I put the wrong answer again, okay. You know, this, this goes to show I am a Pokemon master. What's next? Kirtaboga uses apricots, yes. What? I accidentally put it- You know, sometimes I'm good at Pokemon, other times I'm not. Finally! Oh my god. Why was that so difficult? Dude, Whitney was right, it was difficult. Wow, you did it, I thought the answer to the third one was surely apricots. Oops, I it's time to get back- Okay, there we go, now we're gonna be able to challenge Whitney. Now, luckily, since this is an ultimate randomizer Nuzlocke, she's not gonna have her stupid milk tank. But I'm- I'm a bit afraid as to what she's gonna have in- in replacement for it. Honestly, like, I don't know, man. Tad bit afraid. Now, the big thing we gotta figure out, like, immediately is what type is this gym? Because if we can figure out this type, then we can easily just sweep through the gym and be good to go, basically. Alright. I don't remember exactly how you go through here, but I, I think I have a, I think I have a decent idea as to how you go through here. If I'm not mistaken, yeah, 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 we're already here. All right, what are you? Are you a steel type? 
Hold up, I'm thinking. Are you? S mm. Let me just, let me try and see if you're steel type or not. Er, that didn't end up well. Jugger, go in real quick. Oh, I don't know. This is this isn't going very well, to say the, to say the least. Let's put you to sleep real quick. Let's just bite. So I'm assuming you were part psychic or something. I don't know, man. This is weird. That was very, very that was that was scary, dude. Uh, since the last episode, I did buy some potions, not many, but like a very small amount. Why not, dude? Hmm. So I say we put Cutter in the front, I guess? I don't know, man. This is weird. Very, very weird, Jim. Alright. If Bite is super effective, then it is. I guess then it is like Psychic or Ghost. It's one of the two. I still can't figure out which is which. Okay. Azuril. Either way, we're good with Bite. Okay, okay. I'm gonna go fight up the rest of the gym leaders and heal up so I shall see a guy- the gym leader, yeah. I meant to say the trainers. I'm gonna go fight up the rest of the trainers in this gym, which is like two of them. And then go heal up, so... BRB! Alright, so we're back here, and um, before we continue, Kata kinda got a little overleveled. I didn't want him to get this overleveled, but uh, it kinda just happened. Mostly because of some of the, like, the last two trainers I fought, uh, one of them had like two legendaries. They had like a Dark Rye and a Reggie Rock, so that was cool. So I guess it's time though. Hi, I'm Whitney. You, I saw you at the radio tower just now. Everyone was into Pokemon, so I got into it too. Pokemon are super cute. You want a battle? I'm warning you, I'm good. Uh, and it is Joe. <laughs> I was hoping it would be a guy's name, and it is. We're challenged by Clerk Joe. Okay. Nice. So you're starting off with an Abra, which I still don't know if it's if it's like a psychic or a ghost type, so this is odd. Either way, it's gonna do it's gonna one-shot it. Nice! Oh uh, god, I feel so overpowered right now. Yanma. Okay. Yeah, we kinda got lucky with Whitney here because uh for all I know, it could have just been like it could have been like some it could have been like some insanely strong legendary and then we would have struggled probably. No, we're at least lucky enough to the point where it's not stupid like whatever legendary or s something. Poor me says Whitney <laughs> or Joe, my bad. Can't be calling Whitney Joe, it's Joe. Did a lot less damage that time. But one more hit after this, and we should be good, honestly. Magnitude, ooh, Didn't do much, luckily. Uh, for God's sake, really? Come on, don't do this to us. Don't just stall. Is this, is this how you're gonna stall instead of just the milk tank healing up itself? Alright, it flinched. It's gone. That was another easy gym battle. Dude, I'm just- I don't- <laughs> I don't like the fact that we're only getting easy gym battles. Like, I guess you could be like, oh, you're over level, that sort of thing. Like, even there, it's not like we were one-shotting the Yanma or something. We one-shot the other one, but we didn't one-shot the the Yanma. Where? Where? This is- You meanie. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I just- I just love the fact that she- <laughs> oh no, you made Whitney cry. It's okay, she'll stop shooting. She always cries when she loses. Nice. Oh, what? What are, do, do we just gotta keep talking to you? Oh, right, I forgot. Here's the plane badge. <laughs> nice. Blah, 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 okay. Oh, you can have this too. I have a feeling they purposefully put in the whole crying thing. For like the people that that like they put in the milk tank, and they were like, "Oh yeah, we we should just make her cry because every every player is probably just like I hate this thing." And if they if they did do that on purpose, obviously just just because of the milk tank's existence, then they did a good job. That's what every that's what every trainer wanted to see after they beat Whitney, and that stupid milk tank. All right, anything special going on now? I'll take that as a no. Oh boy, oh boy. Let's go heal up our Pokemon, because obviously, it's like a bit of a beating. We want to make sure they're all right. Now, um, I guess we'll just continue on. I'm not too sure, man. I, I'm not always the most, um, the most, yeah. I'm not always the best at remembering where we got to go in certain Pokemon games, especially Heart Gold. 
considering it's one of the games I've only played through about once, really. I mean, we got some trainers here, and I should have switched Cutter from the front, honestly. But, um, as I was saying, like, this has been one of the... It's basically one of the Pokemon games I've played the least, so it's like I have the least experience with it, and as a result, it's just... It's just a bit of a foreign experience to me, I suppose, I guess. I, I guess you can say that. I don't know, man. Call it whatever you want. It's, it's just weird. Uh, can we avoid you? Yes, we can. Dang it! I knew that was too good to be true. I knew something was just gonna- I knew something was just gonna be like, Haha, you thought you were gonna get past here? Just kidding. Alright, not bad. Finally, Shiny's getting a bit of leveling here, which is great, because Shiny has not been getting much use on the team due to the fact that it's not evolved at all. So it's very, very dangerous to use Shiny, because it's like, these Pokemon, maybe, they're not gonna easily one-shot it, but it's like, I don't want to risk Shiny, if you get what I mean. Because, uh, as I said in the previous episode, I don't want to, I specifically don't want to just stupidly play with the, um, with the Pokemon that are named after viewers, especially, because it's like, somebody spent time right at, oh, Shiny. Well, as soon as I say that, okay. Ain't this something. Ain't this something. There we go. Oh, God. That was... Come on, really? Right? <laughs> the worst part was, that's right when I was talking about it when it happens. I'm so sorry to the person that I named, um, the horsey after. Ugh, I didn't expect us to have to do this, um, so quickly, like... Luckily, luckily, this is not, like, first or second episode death. This is, like, what, episode whatever death? Six, I think? I don't know, something like that. But, uh, I'm so sorry. We lost one. But, um, I, I guess we can easily just, like, pick out a Pokemon we got here. I forgot to train up the Onyx. My bad. I'll do that next time. Uh, I say we pick up Mr. Krabs real quick. Why not, dude? Mr. Krabs is a pretty decent Pokemon on our, um, in our, in our extras here. It may only be, um, Water and Ghost type, but that's honestly not that bad of a typing. Even though it does open itself up to a lot of weaknesses, it's also a pretty just decent typing in general. Now, of course... I'm gonna be a lot more careful. I'm so sorry to that person because they're probably like, oh, how could you do this, you stupid whatever? I don't know. Oh, for God's sake. Yes, fall asleep. Let me go rock tomb. That didn't do anything. And you're just gonna are you are you just gonna double team? You're just gonna double team a ton, okay. Oh for God's sake. Oh my god. I hate you. So very much. No. Okay. I'm gonna put Mr. Krabs in the front. I don't know if it's gonna be a good idea or not. It's probably not. But you know, may as well try. Are we able to go to the little Pokeathlon place at the moment? Oh yeah, we are. Cool. Hi there. Wah! Hmm. I feel it. The twinkle in your eyes. The twinkle of friendship. You're quite something. Your Krabby is quite a Pokemon. It's ready to participate in the Pokeathlon, bud. Most of all, your sol your solitary with the choice of the Pokemon makes me believe in infinite potential. All right, follow me. I'm not even gonna lie. Like one of the one of the most memorable parts for me from uh, Heart Gold obviously has to be the Pokeathlon because like this was this was like one of the first times they had done something like this, and it, it was just so cool, dude. It's it's just like whoa, like. It's this cool little thing. Also, they had this. Oh yeah, this. I forgot about this. But it was so cool. Especially the especially with the fact that you obviously can walk around with your Pokemon. Like, that's even cooler. But uh, let's let's get out of here. Let's just continue on. We're trying to make progress. We're not trying to just do whatever here. Hey, we're at the National Park. Okay. Do we got anything in this? Oh no, I don't want to talk to you. What do you gotta say? Uh, sure, dude. Have a cam photo taken. Oh my god. 
<laughs> oh my god, I forgot that was a thing. Oh, and you can see them on your PC as well. Oh my god, that's so cool. I completely forgot about that. So I don't remember if we're just supposed to continue out over here or what. But I guess we'll see in a second. Obviously, let's play carefully and not stupidly. Um, I'm gonna switch immediately. Oh, no. Um, I'm trying to think. Back to Mr. Krabs. Really, you're gonna dig again? Okay, fine. Water balls. Of course, of course. Right when I thought you were like a whatever type, you're, you're just like, nope, I'm completely different than what you may even begin to think. Oh, God. Uh, let's send it Susan, why not? Let's go for the Dark Void to make our lives easier. Come on. Why do you have judgment? You are a spoink. That's like the most horrifying move I've ever seen a spoink have. Water gun. Oh, Jesus. Alright, luckily you are dead now. That's like the most deadly spoink I've ever gone up against. Alright, let's hope this Marowak has no super effective moves against you. Well, you had one against it, so that's great. Okay, that's back to there. Okay, luckily we just happened to have a burn heal because that would have just been annoying just to have to deal with that. Alright. So let's continue on. I don't know if you're a trainer or not, but uh, hi there. I'm the flower shop's Floria. Listen, listen. When I sprinkled water on this wiggly tree, it jumped right up. It just has to be a Pokemon. I bet it would be okay. Uh, let's see. Let's make sure we have a uh, cut in the front. Why not? <laughs> let's also heal you up a little bit more. Just in case. Alright. Wait, what? Oh, do we have to go get- oh, we have to go get the water bucket or whatever, so <laughs> let me go do that. Alright, there we go. So she gave us this squirt bottle, whatever, the little little flowering, watering can thing. And now we can use that on the... what's going- what seems to be pseudo wudo. Who knows what it's gonna be, though? I swear to God, if it is a legendary, it better not be a legendary. Okay, okay, we're gonna see here in a second. What's it really gonna be? What is this pseudo wudo gonna be? It's clearly not gonna be a pseudo wudo, but um, let's let's try, I guess. So bag and a squirt bottle. Oh, we can't use it. Okay, I guess I guess we just select you now. Use a squirt bottle. Yes. Oh dang it! I was hoping it'd make its noise before whatever. <gasps> a Travage! Oh my god, this is awesome! Alright. Let's hope we can catch you. Alright. Um. Oh no! We don't have any Pokeballs! I didn't realize that! And it was super effect! Oh no! <sighs> Dang it! I was hoping we would have Pokeballs so we could catch the Trapinch, because that would have been so cool, dude! What's the last time you've been able to use like a Flygon in Heart Gold and Soul Silver? Never, that's when. Stop giving me berries. <laughs> Alright, whatever. So I guess we should go get some at the moment because like, you got uh, Violet City right here, so may as well. Let me also heal up while, while I'm at it. Ah, oh, that's a bummer though. <laughs> I was hoping we'd be able to get a nice little encounter here, but uh, nope. We might be able to get another one though, because you know there's the root up there and stuff. Alright. Uh, let's get some Pokeballs. How many can we get? We can get a bunch of them, so let's get like 20 of those. And then Great Balls, we can't get many. Let's get three of those. Why not? Just in case. Just last resorts, basically. That's what they are. Alright. So we'll just head back here, and, um... Now we have this route, if I'm not mistaken. Is it a completely different route, though? That's what I'm... That's what I'm not, I'm not too sure of. Quick Claw! Ooh! That could be actually really useful. Okay. Yes, it is a different route, so we're good. Alright, what is our encounter here? Our encounter is... Delcaddy. Okay. That's a weird one, but sure, why not, man? 
All right, now, as I said, I don't- I'm afraid of attacking it at the moment. Oh, God. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ. Astonish. Doesn't do much. Just keep using it. All right, let's heal you up, though, because I don't want to- I, want, I don't want to lose another Pokemon here, dude. All right. Now back to Kutta. Now Grass Whistle. And now we should be able to catch you very easily, or so I would assume. If not, that's just gonna suck, honestly. Nope. Let's keep trying. Okay, let's try Grape Ball then. Nice! Okay, we're good. Not bad. Fire Ground. Okay, that is... <laughs> that's just an odd type, dude. Alright, let me bring up my list. And, um... Even though I know it is a... A female, because it's a Del Caddy or whatever. I'm going to be naming it after Liquid, whoever that is. I forgot, I'm sorry, this is like over a week after I looked at the comments. So that's why I don't remember him. Liquid! Not even bad. Okay. But, um, oh wait, I'm pretty- let's just get to- let's just get to critique before we decide to continue, honestly. Alright. And, of course, we get an encounter! <laughs> Let's put up a repel. Okay, where is it? Repel. There we go. Oh wait, wait, wait! I didn't even check out the TM that Whitney gave us. Seed flare. Eh. It's all right, I guess. We could sell it at the very least. And of course, you just happen to turn around right as we we're gonna continue on. But nope, you're dead now. There we go. And we can't even go through this way. I thought we were gonna be able to go through this way. Also, I just remembered this is like the little area from, from like the demo of this game. Oh my god! I, oh no, oh no, 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 no. This is this could be very, very bad if we're not careful. All right. Um. Luckily, you took that out in one hit. Can't say the same for the Palkia though. Pokey is our biggest threat right now. What? What? Uh, okay then. Certainly didn't expect that. That was just sort of. Uh, that was kind of out of nowhere. I'm very much afraid of you now, Abra. Are you kidding me? Alright, luckily Abra's gone now, but I'm still- what? Just- I'm gonna obviously need to look at that when I'm editing it and everything, but like, what happened? Like, what in the world happened? I- it's just- I look- I look away for one second and suddenly, we lost Jugger. Oh my god, why? <laughs> That's two Pokemon in one episode. Oh, hello? Oh, it's- it's Bill? I don't remember, man. Hi, I'm Bill, and who are you? Hmm, Luna, huh? You know what? I'm the one whom developed uh, blah, blah. Okay, I don't- I don't care, blah blah blah. Girl from Lynette. Okay, 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 cool. I don't care, Bill. This isn't Johto. Ugh, great, great, great. Now we gotta- now we gotta store away- Now we gotta store away Jugger. Oh my god. Of course we lose the two Pokemon that are named after viewers. I'm so sorry to those people. I'll be sure to well obviously now we have two that are that are named by viewers or whatever. I'm going to I'm going to make sure I level up those two and um I don't know which one I'm going to pick. I'm certainly not picking Egghead at the moment, but I'm going to pick one of these two. I don't know which one at the moment yet, but that's going to be it for this video. It might be like a couple minutes shorter than the usual, but if you have enjoyed, go ahead and drop a like and a comment. Be sure to subscribe if you're really feeling it and that's going to be it for this video. I shall see you guys next time. See you.